Hey guys, Dan Hood here. Sorry I haven't gotten this done sooner than now. Continuation of this. It's all sanded to 320 grit. Um, you, can, you can wet sand it a little bit if you want. I, I normally don't unless I find a spot that really needs it. Okay. Normally I go straight to the loose leaf buffing wheel. Okay. Now I'm going to get everything set up and I'm going to get to polishing this. Okay. And I'm going to cut it right back in in a second. Okay guys, let's get rolling. Hopefully it doesn't get too noisy for you. Now you notice I'm doing it really lightly. I'm not pushing it in. I'm just gently going at it. see guys you just go real gentle on it keep patching it this is a loose leaf let me show you what that means this is a loose leaf polishing gloss you can see nothing stitched except right at the center where it's put together now you just go around gentle hold on now you can see let's see if I can get this right 
you can see it's already gone glossy okay now I still need to clean up the center we're going to quickly clean up the center piece of t-shirt terry cloth up the middle of the dowel okay about that one okay it spins spins like this so you want to wrap the opposite way <laughs> guys so now, for the most part I'm done I'll put what I do now what I do now is I normally just kind of you know wipe it down with a cloth okay then I sit and look at it you know over the next day or two I kind of look at it I'll find those one or two spots that I know still need cleaning I may find a spot that you know don't much care for whether maybe the finish is too thin or something and you know you do your little repairs as you go along but for the most part you know this sucker's done okay uh, I'll wipe it down and I maybe come down here for five more minutes and run one of the polishers a bit on it in one or two spots maybe run this in the middle okay or maybe run this to touch it up a little bit but everything's got to be gentle guys okay that's all I can say anyway take care <laughs>